All right, here's Up North Kid here. Uh, this is the first video I've ever done on this tractor. Uh, it is a Murray 12 horse, 40 inch cut, used to be. Uh, it has shift on the go, six speed, and it has original three inch pulley in the front, uh, changed pulley in the back. I have going to post some pictures of the drive system and some other stuff. But I have a welded chain bumper here that I took a day to weld and did a camouflage trim, white, custom white uh, stripes. Here is my grill. Uh, this right here, uh, I custom made. It has a, I hope this, I pronounced this white, right. It's a, uh, they're K walls, uh, six inch LED lights. They are waterproof. Uh, you can get them on Amazon for like 15 bucks. I had wired them in to the, the key switch where you would have your stock um, lights switch for these Murray's. Pretty nice, They're nice and bright. They're great. I mean, they hardly use up any of the battery. And uh, we have a uh, um, we have locked front articulating uh, axle for stability. Put, drilled two holes and put bolts in them. Uh, original or tires, they do have high speed bearings because this thing runs about 20 miles an hour. I have uh, a little mini stack just for because the old the old muffler was kind of messed up. I have uh, let's see, I have fender flares because once this thing goes about 20 miles down 20 miles an hour down the trail or road it really throws up a lot of mud and debris. This is a lawn edging, um, or aluminum lawn edging that I had cut. And these are self-tapping quarter inch screws that go down through the fender. And uh, I did paint the rims black just for fun. Original tread. And I have something I've never seen anybody do, but I guess I'm the first person to do it as far as I know. So I've actually hooked up a car radio to the system and I believe it turns on I don't know my battery might be I don't know I have to check it but uh, it has uh, a foot throttle so no need for the cable except for um, choke that's all the way up it has a uh, Dixie horn for uh, hold on one minute here we go So that is your uh, Wolo Dixie horn that I had wired up into a switch here. And like I said, I had wired the, the headlights into the key switch. And uh, I have a, I don't know what year this came off of. It's an old bucket seat from an Alice Chalmers tractor. And I just used some of the, the leaf spring mounts. I did the mod for recharging the battery while you're running by Fearless Front. Did that um, custom grill or rack here? A uh, small ATV rack, it's bed linered and painted over for the best finish. And uh, the, the bed liner I use is Duro Color uh, spray bed liner. And here we have a repurposed CB antenna that's a dune flag slash radio antenna receiver or antenna. And we got the shifter and the foot pedal. That's off of uh, an old bike. I think it's my sister's bike. She doesn't use it anymore. And all I have is it just goes, it just mounts to a hole that I have this little piece in the shop here. And I drill the hole in a part of the linkage. I believe this one right here, I have a return spring here. That's just hooked on here. And, uh, yeah, these are uh, very good setup. Got the exhaust. So uh, let me know how you think. What you think of this machine? I've had a lot of fun building it. Certainly not done with it, but uh, let me know and uh, give me your thoughts. This is up north, kid. Thanks.